Dusty, or a complex plasma, is a four-component plasma system. It consists of electrons, ions, neutral atoms, and charged particulate matter, which is what we call the dust. Because the dust grains are, are large compared to the ions and electrons and the neutrals, it slows down plasma physics, it slows it down to the point where you can directly watch the individual particles move, you can see waves, you can see all sorts of the types of, of plasma phenomena that occur in a normal plasma, but you can actually watch them with the naked eye. There are two really good examples of naturally occurring dusty plasmas. One of them would be the environment around Saturn, Saturn's rings, where the charged ice and dust particles that form the rings are a form of natural dusty plasma. Another area would be in planetary nebula, where the large dust structures that you see there are also a form of a dusty plasma. The MDPX facility, the Magnetized Dusty Plasma Experiment, is a new user facility. It is an attempt to create for the first time a fully magnetized dusty plasma environment where the ions, the electrons, and the charged dust particles are all will be subject and be controlled by the magnetic field. It is a, a four Tesla superconducting magnet system or about 80,000 times stronger than the Earth's magnetic field. The whole thing rotates so that we can orient the magnetic field relative to gravity. Each of the four coils are independent of each other so we can actually shape the magnetic field. When fully assembled, it's over two meters long. So it's a very large plasma volume combined with these large magnetic fields. We think that really gives us sort of the unique capabilities of the, of the system. We will be exploring a, a new area of, of complex dusty plasma research, understanding the fundamental behavior of the dust, how it moves in the plasma, whether or not particles can grow in the presence of magnetic fields, can they organize themselves. All of those uh, naturally occurring phenomena occur in the presence of plasma and in the presence of dust and magnetic fields. To add a new degree of freedom to the system is is what physicists love to do, and that's what makes this project really, really exciting to us.